Hey guys, this is Nathan. Welcome to Punter's Pre-Mortem. The Triple X Special this weekend comes off at Rose Hill Gardens, race 8 over the 2,000 metres in the Sky High Stakes, number 10, Masters of Wine. Dead Set going to be sitting down to a nice Chinese meal and a couple of bottles of nice wine. Don't know what the number or brand of that is, but you're going to be doing that. Wait, clear second. Is there anything you can't do, Master of Wine? Very promising star and a dominant win today. Mush. Yep, a $2.50 winner. Totally disregards the 30% drop in the share market, but a winner's a winner. I appreciate everyone watching the show and thanks for taking the time to watch this peanut yell at the camera. I hope you all stay safe and your families too. Peace. Championships day one. Champion, 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 champion. Let's get straight into it. With all the rain and all this shit we've been having, I'm just hoping that we get a fair and even track at Randwick on Saturday. Oh, I should have a cry, Nath. The Triple X Special this weekend comes up at Randwick race 10 over the 1200 meters in the PJ Bell. Number two, Rubisaki. <laughs> Dead set gonna need to have two showers putting this as the best bet near odds on 220 the last I looked it's the best bet of the weekend so take it or leave it the rain's not gonna hurt this girl just like with your missus on the Saturday night the wetter the better she's just a super filly every time they raise the bar she keeps stepping up last start at Flemington over the 1400 meters beat a strong crop of three-year-old fillies down there comes up here nowhere near as tough a race Already ticked the right-handed way, winning the English Millennium Sprint in Sydney. On Barry 2, Nashi Boy can get her about midfield. Wet track, race 10 at Randwick. They're going to fan. She's going to find the way through. She's got an electric turn of foot. Going to blow this lot away. At 5.50, get on the phone. Order your Chinese. Can't go there. Take away PT, bitches. The cheeky, sneaky, each way better the weekend comes up at Ramwick, race five over the 2,600 metres. Number, number three, Gaelic Chieftain. Now is his time. Chieftain time. Third up, ready to peak. This is his guy's profile. Takes a couple of lead up runs to get fit. Goes bang third up. Did this last year into the autumn on a soft track. In the spring, third up as well. Almost a Metropolitan winner at Group 1 level. Just picked by Come Play With Me. Link is back on. And our old mate, JC Boy. Love you, mate. Gonna give this a real shake and nine bucks. I'm gonna be shooting for the lobster. Doesn't appear to be a lot of speed on paper. Angel of Truth going forward. From Barrier 1, JC Boy get him a nice spot right in the middle of the field. Muddling run affair. Creep into it when he needs to. Two things you know about this guy. He likes a little bit of moisture downstairs and he'll run the trip, no problems. At the rise, Collett can get stuck into this big bull, run away with this one. After the race, you can't wheel your wheelbarrow up to Robbie and ask him to fill it out. You're gonna have to get out your phone, refresh it, close your eyes and just think about all that toilet paper that you can't buy to wipe your bum hole, tippy. The Group 1 GG this weekend comes up Ramwick, race eight over the 1200 meters in the TJ Smith. Number seven, Bivouac. So James, how's he been going at the track? Oh, Nate, he's he's dead set flying, mate. I mean, fuck. Look at me, mate. Look at me. I'm flying. I'm fucking flying. Far out, though. Get out your dartboard. Throw some at it. You still couldn't find the winner if you pick six of them. I've gone through a different sort of form line. You think about the Everest in the spring. Same field. Yes, yes, yes. Touch them up. Bivouac has beaten that horse three times at 1,200 meters. And from barrier six, even if Hugh Bowman has a snooze and doesn't ride him out, he's still gonna get the gun run. Go forward, just sit behind Nature Strip. Vega Days pushes forward, gonna get the gun run right in there. Second or third on the rail, one out, one back. Nature Strip's not gonna have a Yogi Bear picnic. Vega Day is gonna piss him off up front, buzz him up a bit. He's a better horse when you can sit off them, hold on to the bridle as long as he can, then go bang. Fourth up, he's not going to have had enough yet. Wet track, no concern. Fuck me, it's a lottery, but with five bucks, I'm going to be all over him. What can I say? I just can't stop writing that. James coming D. Ah! 